Donny P here. Welcome to week 18. So just an update. Last video I had told you guys that I was heading out for the uh, last blood tests that needed to be done before I can get approved and go for the uh, stem cells. So blood test results came back and uh, got my phone call that I'm all approved. A-okay. And the date is 100% set. I'm heading to Florida on... Um, July 13th. That's the uh, the first of the three days of the stem cell therapy. So I'm extremely excited. And uh, yeah, when that phone call came in, I was dancing around the house, sending my oxygen levels down, <laughs> actually. But the dance was cool. I I called my wife and called my family, and I even sang to my cats. I was just so extremely happy at that phone call that I got and. Then I went online and I saw a bunch of different uh, notifications from the groups that I belong to. A lot of people were writing that they're sending prayers and they're wishing me the best of luck. And a ton of people are like, give me feedback and let me know how you're doing. We're kind of living through you. We want to see how that procedure works. And as I say in, in all my videos since the inception, and I even put a disclaimer up that I don't advocate any modalities, any procedures, everything that I'm doing is solely for myself and I'm kind of living it online and posting my results. The only thing that I do advocate is having a proper mindset. It's so important that you stay focused and that you stay positive in anything that you do in life, especially if you're trying to fight a disease. And unfortunately, I got some negative feedback, not as much as the positive, I have to say, but some negative um, posts were put up how stem cells are no good, it just doesn't work, and I found that like incredible that I had to read that because I'm really trying, like I say, to keep my mind so positive. And um, I'll give you an example. Let me grab this one book that's fantastic is uh, Lisa Rankin, Mind Over Medicine. That speaks so much about how the proper mindset can uh, make or break how you handle any disease or any, you know, anything that's going wrong inside your body. Um, this is fantastic. This is, uh, let's see, You Are the Placebo by Dr. Joe Dispenza. And it's, it's amazing. Again, it speaks to mindset as well as Dr. Bruce Lipton's The Biology of Belief, and that's epigenetics. It's a science that shows that our emotions and our feelings absolutely have an effect on the cells and the biology in, in our body. I mean, if you have a negative attitude towards things in your life, I think everyone can agree that you're not gonna feel that great if you stay in, in a state of negativity versus a state of positivity. So I would just say to people in general everywhere, I would think twice before you shoot somebody down and, and, and poo poo something. I guess what I'm just trying to say is that uh, there are so many people that are posting what they're doing and they're going for lung transplants. I support everybody. I mean, that's what it's all about. That's what my channel's about. Let's all get together and let's put our positive thoughts together and let's pray for each other and, and actually expect the best outcomes. So for instance, I would never in a million years if somebody was posting that they were going for um, lung transplant, I wouldn't write to them maybe two weeks before they go for the transplant of all the uh, the mortality rates or how dangerous the operation is or the rejection rates or the medication. Everybody can choose to do what's right for them and I would say God bless you and I pray for you and I wish you the absolute best outcome. I would never want to ruin their psyche or put them in a bad mood and point out certain statistics. And I just really feel like I need to throw that out there and share that. That was my experience. Uh, I'm over it. I'm extremely happy. And I'm looking at all the positive people that wrote to me. And God bless you guys. You're really making me feel so good. And I can't wait to post the results and take you along on my journey. That's what this is all about. And another positive uh, thing that happened this week is... Uh, a friend from years and years ago that we have reconnected. She is a uh, singer-songwriter, her name is Robin Eve, and she also owns a cleaning company, and she uh, volunteered, she came over and with my wife, she said, I wanna fix up your place and, and make it as dust-free, I want to give like the best cleaning that we can do so when you get back you're breathing in only the freshest air and you have the perfect environment. I mean it was just amazing and I want to thank her. So that was yesterday. Uh, myself, mainly her and my wife just like tackled the house like crazy. It was amazing. 
And that's pretty much what happened this week. I got you guys updated. Um, I really love when you guys send me the comments that you're doing and giving my videos a thumbs up. And I know that you're out there and people are digging it and watching what's happening. And hopefully I'm having a positive impact on people's lives. This is why I do the channel. And please share these videos, tell your friends to subscribe, and uh, have a great rest of your week. I want to say, as I say at the close of every video, I'll say it again, make sure that you live inspired. Oh, 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 oh,